Hey everyone, this is Andrew from Senior Apps. Today we're going to look at adding a button in Xcode to open up a page in a Facebook app. And if the user doesn't have that installed, it's going to open it up in Safari. So first of all, we're just going to get our button here to open up our Facebook page. So we're just going to create an action for that. Like us on Facebook. Now that we've got our button here, what we need to do, we need to declare the URL of our Facebook page. So to do that, we do nsurl Facebook URL web equals nsurl alloc, then init with string. So we do a URL here of our Facebook page. So in this tutorial, we're going to look at this CMU Apps Facebook page. It's going to grab that link there and put it in here. And what we're also going to need is the ID of the Facebook page. So this is a unique number that every Facebook page has. And basically, we need that to open it up in the Facebook app if it is installed on the user's device. So what we want to do, just copy this NS URL change it to Facebook URL ID. Now in here what we're going to do, we're going to do FB colon slash slash profile slash. Now what's going to be after this slash is a unique number of that Facebook page. So to get this what we do, just copy that Facebook URL again. And go Just go to Google and go get Facebook page ID. Is this website here, findmyfacebookid.com. Just put your page in here, look up ID, and then you'll get your unique Facebook page ID. So once we've got that, just put that in the end here. Okay, now that we've got this set up, we need a way to check if the Facebook app is installed on the iPhone. So to do this, what we do, we do if... UI application, shared application, can open URL, and then we do FB URL ID. Now we do else, put an else statement here. So basically, this line here checks if the Facebook app is installed. If it is, it will run the code in this area here. Otherwise, it will run the code in here. So if the Facebook app is installed, we go UI application, shared application, open URL, and then we do the Facebook URL ID. There we go. Otherwise, we're just going to copy that line and we're going to open up the actual Facebook link in Safari. Okay, and now we're going to test the app. So what we're going to do, we're just going to run that. Now in our simulator, because we can't install Facebook, it should just open up our Facebook page in the website, so we'll just check that out. So like us on Facebook, opens it up in Safari. So if this was running on an actual iPhone that had Facebook installed, it would open it up within the Facebook application. So I've included the source code below you can find a link for that and also remember to subscribe for more tutorials.